Uh, my name is Jeff Roin, and this is just going to be a quick tutorial on how to take a PowerPoint, uh, add voiceover, and turn it into a video. So it's just a playable video that you can use. And this is just a random presentation I had from a couple years ago from a class, so I'm just going to use this for the demo. Just three slides. And so once you have your presentation made, you have all the slides, you're going to do the voiceover for each one, and it lets you do this individually. And first thing you're going to do is go to insert, come across to audio, and then the bottom option is record audio. And it's just going to pull up the sound recorder. Okay, so you do that, and on the slide, you just, once you're ready, you hit record. And assuming you have your microphone plugged in, you're just going to record the voiceover, explain the slide as if you were presenting it to an audience. And once that's done, you hit stop. If that went the way you wanted it to, just hit OK. Otherwise, you can hit record, and it'll record over what you just did. Okay, and then this little logo here indicates that you have a voiceover on this slide now. And then you can do that for each one. Like I said, it lets you do this individually for each slide, which is very convenient, because you can do a few takes, make sure you get everything right. And just do the recording. Same thing, you're just going to voice over each one. And you can always play them back, make sure you're happy with each one, kind of craft it to make sure it's going to present the way you want it to, and it times out correctly. And the length of the total video is going to depend on how long all these are added together. It does a pretty good job of making it pretty seamless once it makes it into a video. Okay, so once you have that done, go up to File, Save As, and it'll have the option of a Windows Media Video here. And so what that's going to do is it's automatically going to convert it into a video for you, one continuous video that you can upload or send to somebody. Okay, so you hit save. And it's going to look now like you just saved it as if it was a normal PowerPoint, but you want to keep an eye up down here. This is where you can see the bar where it's recording. It takes much longer for it to convert to video than it does to do a standard uh, PowerPoint save. So this little bar is going to go all the way up. It's going to take a few minutes, especially if you have, I mean, this is only three slides, and it'll take two or three minutes, but if you have a lot, it might take 20 or 30 minutes. But once it's done, you'll have a playable video at the end. Thank you for watching, and you can email me if you have any questions.